guys, what's up? LD Shadow Lady here and welcome back to Trollcraft. First things first, we did it, you guys. We successfully lured and pranked a lot of the other players on the server down into my secret lair full of traps and a lot of them died down here many times. Watch them burn. Oh, oh, Jesus, birds, calm yourself down. What do the buttons do? Do they do anything? Where am I? What's going on? What's happened? Am I falling? <gasps> what? 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 So, mission accomplished. I think we taught those nosy people a jolly good lesson. And now we just close up this staircase and never open it again because it's just too dangerous to go down there anymore. Moving on. So, I hope you guys had a wonderful Christmas. I sure did. And I got some lovely gifts from the people of the server. So, first of all, I got this scarecrow from Yami. So, let's figure out why am I on fire? What? Did that just set me on fire? I don't remember using Emberium as a doormat. Who put that there? Or why is it setting me on fire? That's not a very Christmassy thing. As I was saying, we need to figure out where to put this scarecrow. So, I think if we put him right beside the door here, he might ward off all the horrible spirits. Oh, <gasps> he's moving. He's so cute. Well, isn't that snazzy? Now I can sit here and enjoy my deck chair in peace, knowing that my scarecrow boyfriend is watching over me, protecting me. Oh, I feel so safe with him. He's only got 20 HP, so I'm not sure what he's gonna do if somebody actually attacks, because he's definitely gonna die. <gasps> oh, blummin' heck! Stupid fire! Now, we also got a bunch of presents from various different places. I collected a load from the mobs that dropped them. How kind of them. And I also got one from CBK and Yami. So let's open them up. <gasps> Wait, what? I thought they were all good. What is that? Krampus? Oh, Krampus, you set my house on fire. Oh my gosh, I'm going to die. Let's get out of here. What the heck is that? Oh, blooming heck. I need some water. Help, help me. Oh, what is that? A hell, Quinn? Oh my gosh, what is going on? Why have all the Christmassy things gone all satanic? I have half a heart left and I need to kill Krampus. Oh my gosh, there he is. All right, let's do it. I'm doing it. Ah! Oh, Krampus was slain by Elder Shadow Lady. And now I am Krampus. Ooh, things look a lot brighter. Oh, I'm beautiful. Oh, I can't actually get around my house though. Oh, what a sad existence. Now I know why Krampus is so angry. He can't fit through any doors. Okay, let's open up some more presents. Hopefully there's no more Krampus. <laughs> oh, blooming heck, what is that? Good tidings I bring. A salty tree? What? None of these presents seem to be very good. Ah, <laughs> not again. Good tidings That was I Rudolph? For me. Why is Christmas being ruined by all these horrible things? <sighs> Here's your present. Oh, that was actually some good things. An ender pearl, a burger, and some pie. Okay, I think I need my super duper armor to open the rest of these. Because this is a lot more dangerous than I first thought opening presents would be. Maybe we should do it outside as well. Unleash the present. <laughs> ah! Oh, good it's a hideous tree. I bring for me. <laughs> oh my gosh, what is that? Good tidings I bring. It's a giant salty tree. Bless. <laughs> Here's your Ooh, present. Ooh, diamonds. <laughs> Ooh, what's that? Good Satan Claus! Satan Claus is dying! Apparently he's allergic to the sun. Who knew? Oh, sorry, Satan Claus. Goodbye. <laughs> ah! Oh my Good gosh! It's Rudolph! Oh, he's fast. Me. Quick, Rudolph, get in the house. Don't stand in the fire. No, Rudolph! Ah! Rudolph, please! Oh, thank goodness. Oh my gosh, I think he's stuck. Wait, no. No! <gasps> Oh, he's doing a beautiful mating dance. He just needs another Rudolph. Oh, I kind of want to keep him. Can I keep him? I mean, he wants to kill me, but that doesn't mean that's not the good basis for a loving relationship. Ah, I'm going to have to kill him. I'm sorry, Rudolph. All right, 13 more gifts. Unlucky. Ah, not another one. <gasps> what is that? It's like a bodybuilding penguin. Ah, oh my gosh. He's evil. Oh, does that mean I can't keep him as a pet? I really wanted to keep you as a pet. Look, he's got his own cape and everything. Ow. Wait, whoa, whoa, whoa. What are you doing? What the heck? Oh, you're a different thing. Okay, well, you brought this upon yourself by being evil. Okay, the last present. This better be something good. Ugh. Ugh, indeed. That's just some kebabs and a cake. 
Well, we got some good stuff at least. Oh, I'm on fire. But it's okay because I have some sweet armor. Yeah. Now that we've opened all our presents and we got some awful and some good things, I think it's time to bring our attention to this sign, which apparently Ollie has left for us. Come to Birdland for all your bird needs. Now, I don't think I really have any bird needs, but... I'm gonna go check out Birdland anyway. I'm guessing it is right outside Ollie's house because he is way too lazy to walk any further away. What was that? I heard a cat. <gasps> it's a spy cat! It's one of my spy cats. How did you get out? Come on, let's go to Birdland. Oh my gosh, it's that giant chocobo! Ooh, fancy. It's like Disneyland, but for birds. Birdland, one dollar entry. Wait, I don't have a dollar. Ugh! How about I just leave my cat instead? But I'll be back with a dollar, I promise. So, let's enter. Ah! Goblins! Ollie! Birdland isn't safe! Birdland has a lot of evil things. Ah! Oh dear! Oh gosh! This is awful. Why does everything in Birdland want to kill me? At least I found a dollar. Let's just drop that off. Ooh, lots of flamingos. They don't really seem to do much, do they? Yeah. I think I'll take one. Thank you! What else do we have here? Some chickens. Is there more to Birdland than flamingos and chickens? <gasps> chocobos! Oh, it's a little chocobo heaven! There's only one chocobo. And he's already tamed. Well, I think we've seen all there is to see of Birdland now. So I think I'll just take my flamingo home and we'll start a brand new life together. Where does this tunnel go? Oh, what? This is Ollie's house? Ollie lives in a hole in the ground with quicksand. Am I gonna die? Ollie! This is not safe! Oh my gosh! I'm dying in quicksand! Oh, this is horrible. Oh, my worst nightmares! Why does he live in a hole full of quicksand? That's the stupidest thing I've ever heard. But at least we got a flamingo, so I'm gonna pop him right there. He looks so beautiful. Well, we can't just settle for one bird, can we now? I wanna try and get a pet chocobo. So, we need some of these things, I think, to tame the chocobo. And then we'll also need to make a saddle so that we can ride it around. So how do you make a chocobo saddle? String leather and a chocobo feather. Now, luckily, I did happen to pick up a chocobo feather from our little friend in Birdland. And I think we've got leather and string. Here we go. Oh, a chocobo saddle. It looks like a saddle with a unicorn horn. So we have the Geisel greens. We have the chocobo saddle. Now all we need is a chocobo. So where are they at? Oh my gosh. What happened to my sheep? Why are there only two purple sheep in here now? I don't understand. How did they all escape? And why did you stay? Well, it looks like we're going to have to up the security in the sheep pen next time. I don't have time to deal with this right now. I've got a chocobo to catch. Oh, uh, yoo-hoo! Chocoboo-boos! Oh my gosh, what is that? What's wrong with their arms? Come here, you. Oh, they're surprisingly easy to kill. <gasps> Chocoboos! Oh, beautiful chocobos with the rainbow hair, without the rainbow hair. Here, this is for you, my dear. Oh, it's got a little red collar on now. That means it's mine. And then I put the saddle on. Oh, and then I can ride it. Come on, chocobo, let's go. Now, I didn't really think this part through because we don't have anywhere to keep the chocobo right now. My bad. So, we should probably build a little chocobo area. Let's build a little doorway out here, and this will lead to the chocobo garden. Okay, so I've made a little garden area with this beautiful kawaii door to access it. All we need to do is get the chocobo in there. Now, where has he gone? Hello, sir. Let's get you out of here. So we have some gated entrances on the sides here, and hopefully, if I shut these... The perimeter should be secure and our chocobo should not be able to escape. But they always find a way anyway, don't they? So now that we have one chocobo, I'd actually like to get another one because I want the baby chocobos. So our little feathery friend here actually dropped some more feathers, which will enable us to make some more saddles so that we may tame more. More chocobos, more friends. Ta-da! Okay, so I think I need one with the rainbow hair now because one of them is a male and one of them is a female. And if I want to breed them together, I'm gonna need a male and a female. So now we just need a rainbow-haired stallion. Aha! I found one! 
Right, let's tame this guy then. Okay, that, that took all my Geisel greens. Now let's saddle him up and take him home. Actually, we're probably gonna need some more of these too to breed them. So let's collect all of those. Now let's get you safely in the Chocobo Garden. Oh, it looks like they can't actually get over fences, so that's good. Ta-da! Your new lady friend. It looks like they're getting along famously. Oh, we're gonna need a Geisel farm. So let's start that over here in the Chocobo area. Oh my gosh, what are you still doing here? Why do you look so upset? Oh, maybe he wants to get in the Chocobo Garden. You better not kill the Chocobos. I wonder where he came from. Get in there, my son. Yes. Now I have loads of birds. So we'll start the farm over here and hopefully my new birds don't trample the crops. Okay, so now we just need to plant these and hopefully... What? Oh, do I turn them into seeds? Oh, that makes so much more sense. I feel like an idiot. Right, plant these then. Ah, that looks right. So we need a lot more of these things. Now I'm gonna use all of my bone meal to grow them because I am lazy and I don't want to have to wait. Grow, yes grow my pretties. And then let's farm them up. Hopefully we can get some of the stuff that we need. <gasps> yes, we got a lovely guy so that's all we need to start breeding them. <gasps> we got a golden one. Oh, the golden ones give a higher chance of the offspring mutating into a different color. <gasps> That's what we want, isn't it? Yes, it is, ladies and gentlemen. So let's try and get some more golden ones. Ta-da! Ta-da! <gasps> we got one! Oh, finally. I was beginning to lose hope and sanity. Okay, so now what? <laughs> Before we bring a little baby chocobo into the world, we have a few preparations to make. First of all, this pen is actually not suitable for chocobos. Apparently we have to cover the floor in straw and it will make the chocobos happy. And we also need to put a cauldron filled with water in here and they'll be able to regenerate health. So hopefully they won't die. Now let's just start putting this all over the place randomly because I cannot make enough for the whole floor. <laughs> but at least I tried. Plus, it looks hideous, so I don't want to cover the whole floor in this. There you go, that's pretty nice, isn't it? And now we just need the cauldron, and then we'll put this kind of here where they all hang out, and we just need to fill it with water. Boom. There we go. Now I think we're ready to bring a baby chocobo into the world, so let's give them each a golden geisel, and then we wait for a baby. <gasps> Is that it? Oh, it's a little blue one. Oh, that, that was fast. Oh, look, he's so cute. And blue. I love it. Now we just need to wait for this little guy to grow up. I think apparently we can make him a cake and he'll grow up. We can make the cake out of the Geisel greens. So let's quickly see if we can do that. Let's get the recipe. Oh, milk, sugar, egg, wheat. Ugh, why didn't I make a farm earlier? Let's just make a farm near the little scarecrow because that looks cute. Oh wait, there's a farm down here that I made. Totally forgot about that. Now all we need is milk and eggs. So who has cows? <gasps> I know, Scott has cows. I'm just gonna go milk their teats while he's not online. I'm sure he won't notice unless he inspects their udders every time he logs in, which I highly doubt he does. So I think we should be able to get away with it. Scott free, as they say. <sighs> Quickly, milk him before the explosions start. Oh, and we can maybe steal an egg too while we're here. Oh, what's that? Oh no, they're gonna blow up Scott's house. Oh dear. Oh, oh thank goodness. It doesn't look like they did anything bad. Now I'm just gonna stand in this chicken pen until one of you plops out an egg. <gasps> Eggs, thank you. Now, I think we have almost everything we need for the cake. I'm just gonna go and steal some sugar cane from Joel's house. Now, we have to be pretty sneaky because he's actually online right now. <laughs> Aha! I've done it! Now let's go! Oh, look at him! He's so cute! I almost don't want to give him the cake because then he'll grow up. Oh, he's so adorable like that. Okay, let's do it. <gasps> wow! Oh, he's got purple eyes. He's so cute. Oh, now I need a saddle because I want to ride him. Let's make a couple of saddles because I don't know how many we're going to need. If we just keep breeding these chocobos like crazy. Ta-da! Oh, cool. 
Oh, whoa. Oh, yeah. Look at me go. Oh, it's so cute. I need more. I won't be happy until I have them all. I love him. He's my new favorite thing. Okay, let's make sure we keep him trapped in here and safe. There you go, have some fish. Now, if we want to get more colors, I think the next one to get is a green one. So we have to try and breed these guys together and just pray that it's green. So I'm going to use the lovely Geysels. And if you guys can make a green baby, that would be great. Thank you. Whoa! Make a green one. Where is it? Where is it? I heard a noise. I don't see it. I don't see a baby. <gasps> oh my gosh, it's there and it's green! Now, we need another cake. Quickly! Emergency cake is required. Ta-da! Another cake. Okay, so first of all, we need to tame him until he's got the little cute red collar and then we give him the cake. <gasps> Majestic! Beautiful, absolutely beautiful. He's a really nice color, actually. Let's just, uh, let's put a saddle on him and then let's take him for a little ride. Ooh. Oh, there's a cow. We should tame this thing. We should keep him in the chocobo garden and pretend he's a chocobo. We just need to get this cow over here somehow. And I know just how to tempt him. Hey man, there's a lady cow over here. Yeah, she's a hot, hot lady cow. Welcome to the paradise garden. Surrender your milk to me. Thank you. There we go. One more cake. Now, we need to read together the green and the blue chocobo to make a white chocobo. Yes, indeed. Now, hopefully this works, but we'll see. Ta-da. Oh, you've just been born, so I guess you can't breed yet. Whoops, my bad. What else can I do with these feathers? Because I have a lot of them. <gasps> Choco disguise helmet? <gasps> Wow! Okay, guys, I'm gonna need you to drop a lot more feathers. I need this Choco disguise. Let's make the helmet, because that looks cool. And then we can also make the chest plate. Okay, now what does this look like? Oh my goodness, it's everything I dreamed of. Now I just need the full thing. Look how amazing I look. Oh, they love me. Even the cow loves me. But I feel half naked, I need the full thing. No. Shadow game. No, that's not good. Death in the dark. That doesn't sound fun. I don't want that. So if I give them a Geisel green each, hopefully I'll make a baby. Where's the baby? Oh, you made a blue one. What am I gonna do with this? I wonder if anyone else on the server wants a little baby blue chocobo. Wait, I have an idea for you. Now let's take this little guy across to Birdland. I don't think Ollie has actually seen a blue chocobo before. I'm not sure he even knows they exist. So, this should be a big surprise when he logs in. You're gonna love it in Birdland. They've got plenty of birds and more birds and a lot more birds. Actually, they got quite a lot of those. I hope you like flamingos because they have a lot of those. Also, uh, a lot of chickens. Hope you like those too. Behold, Blue Chocobo, your new home. This is the mother Chocobo. That's how you were born. Where'd you go? Why is the lead in the water? <gasps> oh dear, I have lost the Chocobo. Oh, there he is. Oh look, he's even smaller than a chicken. I'm gonna leave you here to grow up nice and strong. And then maybe one day somebody will adopt you. Goodbye, Blue Chocobo. Goodbye for now. Oh, he'll be happy in Birdland. I'm sure Ollie will take good care of him. In fact, Ollie will probably use him to concoct some master plan to take over the world. Maybe I shouldn't have left him there. Oh well, we'll just have to hope for the best. Now, after that ordeal, it should be time to breed the chocobos together again. So, let's see if they'll make a baby. Wait a second. Seven feathers. We have enough for the legs. We can complete the outfit. And I'll be the ultimate chocobo person. Move out of the way, Ollie. I am the ultimate chocobo owner. Let's put my fancy armor on here for now. While I adorn myself in this adorable chocobo outfit. Oh, I'm so happy with myself. Now, so let's breed together the green and the blue to get a white chocobo. Where's the baby? Oh, there it is! Welcome to the world, little baby chickabo. Here you go. Oh, he looks so cute with his little collar on. He looks like a baby chicken. Now, let's give him a cake. And he's not a baby anymore. He's a grown man. Now, 
the next breeding stage that we need to do is a yellow with a white. So we'll need to breed this yellow with this white. Technically, that's your grandma, but we don't talk about that because this is chocobo breeding and it's not like real life where that would be really creepy. <laughs> okay. Oh, all these chocobos are going to need names at some point. So if you guys have any ideas for what to name these beautiful creatures, then leave a comment down below which color and which name you would like for the chocobo. And I will pick only the best for my beautiful chocobos. <gasps> oh, the white one doesn't have a saddle yet. Let's give him a test drive. What? Whoa, what? Is he flying? What? The white one flies? He's kind of rubbish at flying though. What's this all about? This is the worst flight I've ever been on. I can't even fly over my own house. This sucks. Okay, now let's see if we can breed together this one. Ooh. With... Where's the other yellow one? This one. And make a black chocobo. What the heck is happening? Where's he gone? What was that? That was like a flyby mating. That was pretty weird, dude. Did you at least make a baby? Oh, you did! You made a little cute black one! Oh, it's like a little chicken. That's so cute. And look at his little eyes. Okay, let's tame him. Oh, yes. And give him a cake. Oh, magnificent! I shall call you whatever the people want me to call you because I am terrible at coming up with names. Oh, we have so many different ones! There's only one more to get. It's time to breed the white and the black to get a gold! Go! Breed! Okay. What? Oh my gosh, that white bird is crazy. What is he doing? This is some kind of weird mating ritual. There you go. Thank you. <gasps> Finally. It's not a golden one, is it? Or is it? Boom. <gasps> it is a golden one. Beautiful. Now, what's better than a golden chocobo? My final secret surprise for you guys. Dun, dun, dun. Just give me a moment because I wasn't prepared. Da -da. Dun, 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 dun. It's time. Prepare yourself for magnificence. <gasps> it's everything I ever dreamed of and more. Wow. It's beautiful. Oh, yes, it's so perfect. Why am I sliding around? <laughs> oh, dear. Oh, wow, it's fast. Whoa! Oh, now that's flying. Oh, that is really flying. Oh, it's kind of high up, actually. Well, that's it for this episode of Trollcraft. I hope you guys enjoyed it. If you did, don't forget to leave a like and also leave some name suggestions for these beautiful birdy creatures in the comments below. And I will see you in the next episode. I'm inside a chocobo right now.